So, y'all, today, I believe there's a camera in my bedroom that Gilman McKinney put in there, the meth dealer, and he gave access to Randy Davis, and Randy Davis gave it to this man who is psychotic. They shook hands down in this driveway, and after this, this man, I mean, there was a lot of things that let me know that he was looking inside the house already, somehow saw me, because when I would dress in this room, and I'd get ready to pull up my underwear, he would run a drill. Vroom, run, run. So it was after that, because we had a breakdown, and I, I started seeing that he was an evil man. Tried to be friendly to him at first, but he came in my yard and took something without asking. He got my ditch and tore up rocks. He's just, he acts like he's on dope. He acts like he's on meth. And then drinking, I mean, you know, he's not as severe as Gilman was, but you can tell by his behavior, his erratic behavior, his emotional outbursts of cursing me, you know, that he's he's on dope. So, um, I think he does something like meth or speed sometimes, and other times he's doing, he's drinking or maybe doing pain pills or something, but he's out of it. So... He's just been a terrible, terrible, terrible person. The worst I have ever met. Nobody talks to women the way he does. And it's because no man that's a real man is going to talk to women the way he does. He's told me, F you. And the problem is, Chucky Wucky, you're mad because you'll never do that. You'd like to do it, but you will never do it. You'd have to rape me, and you probably are a rapist. You probably raped lot lizards out on the road. You probably raped children. I wouldn't doubt if you raped your own girls because they are totally screwed up. If you didn't molest them and touch them and have sex with them, you molested them with your mouth because you're a filthy mouth person. You had sex with them with your mouth. You're a nasty pervert. So, I believe, you know, many, many, many times, many, many, many times over the past year and a half, when I wear a certain color t-shirt to bed, the next day he'll wear that same color t-shirt. He's just psychotic. And it lets me know that he sees inside my house. He knows when I come in this bedroom to dress. He knows when I'm taking a shower. He knows when I'm in this other room on my computer. He knows when I'm in my bed. He's just, he's psychotic. If I'm in my bedroom, he will come by my windows when uh, it's waking hours. And so today I slept in a little bit. I stayed up late last night until about 2.30. And uh, I, I just... I woke up at 8.30, but I just kind of kept laying there and was just kind of tossing and turning and kept on resting, you know, just resting, trying to get my rest in. And he comes by my windows because he thinks it's time for me to get up. I know that's what he's thinking because he's psychotic. And it's not his first time to do it either. So look at this. He's got half gray and half mint green. Who does that? It was... I mean, there was a really nice light up here that didn't work. He took it down. Because he don't want light out here because then he can sneak around in my yard. He's psychotic. So watch him. Just dumb. He's just weird. 